guys welcome back to the channel it's still site time we're still giving you the site update this is grace city phase three you definitely know this building by now we've been at it for a while the last time that i came you were doing the footings absolutely and i saw the block work a bit of it but today everything is covered what's happening <laughs> <laughs> welcome to site Aguam. thank you um so um the last time I mentioned we are doing the footings. Yes, please. And so what, what we're standing on now is what we call the hardcore feel. Oh. The hardcore feel. Okay. And this material needs to be well compacted. Okay. If you don't compact it very well, you're going to have holes underneath the concrete. So okay. normally this is where we are all going to be standing mm -hmm. on top of the building. Okay. So okay. we have the hall, the washrooms, they are all going to come out after the hardcore has been able to settle. I see. Yes. So this is going to be the ground that we'll stand. So exactly. all the other ones was just, well, hey, construction. <laughs> <laughs> That's very interesting. So um, what happens? I had a uh, estate manager saying there'll be some watering down and then we'll wait for it to be fully compact. Then there'll be a refill again. All right, so what happens is that you can realize that as of now, this is the level of the blocks and we are already okay. up here so yeah, there's a reason why yeah. we have hit the material okay so when the water gets on top of it uh -huh. the water is going to settle so we call this type of soil disturbed soil disturbed yes disturbed so this is the reason now when you are able to excavate a portion of soil okay and you're filling it back it doesn't go Okay. I believe you have seen that before. Yes. What happens is that once you scoop out the sand, mm -hmm. the sand is disturbed. It needs oh. to be able to compact well so Settle that the sand properly. becomes loose. Yes. yes so yes, these yes. are loose soil. Uh -huh. Hence, when you step on it, it's able to go down. Yes. So we need to compact it well. It needs to be very solid. Okay. Before we put the concrete material on top of it. I see. I was told that uh, a bird whispered to me mm -hmm. that the last time mm -hmm. somebody asked, why are we using six inch blocks instead of, instead of nine, nine inch inches hollow? hollow. Yes. So I'm going to explain the reason okay. why. So you see, um, when you get to Africa, mm -hmm. we are using heavyweight materials. Okay. As to lightweight materials used in the West. Outside, okay. So we use a six inch solid block wall uh -huh. to be able to ensure that our base is as strong as possible. Oh, I see. And again, even after that, like I explained the last time, mm -hmm. we are still going to put what we call a ground beam. Yes. Now, I, I've always mentioned, I'm going to talk about the various types of concrete that mm -hmm. we have. Mm -hmm. We have the mass concrete. Okay. We have reinforced concrete. Okay. And then we also have the, what, what somebody call the loose concrete. Lo okay. All right. Or the weak concrete. Okay. So what we are going to employ is the reinforced concrete to be able to ensure that okay. all where our block walls are going to be, mm -hmm. that place is as solid as possible. So that it's able to carry the load that is going to be on top of it. Okay, I see. Yeah. So that's the reason why we chose the six inch block. Exactly. Because you need to have this, your base mm -hmm. as, strong as strong as, as possible. possible. Ah, yes. that's interesting. Yeah. I, I understand that at KE, we like to do things differently to make sure that uh, our clients have nothing but the best. And that's why these explanations are also necessary. So you know the reason why we do the things that we do. But so, see, let me even say that it's mm -hmm. not only about RKE. Yeah. There's a building code that okay. you have to abide by. Mm -hmm. Now, if in construction, mm -hmm. If you don't do something right today, yeah. you pay dearly tomorrow. True, true. So you need, these are standard procedures that you need okay. to be able to follow yeah. to ensure that the building that you are erecting is standing very well. So your, your concrete materials, uh -huh. its thickness, mm -hmm. all those things are vital in whatever we are doing. I see, but if there are codes like that, why do people like to do something <laughs> different at the end well, of the day? <laughs> uh, you see, sometimes like what we're doing here, mm -hmm. Um, we are supposed to have the authorities checking what we are doing. Yeah. But don't forget that the blocks are already buried under the earth. Mm -hmm. So when they come, how would they be able to ascertain? And they yes. cannot be here at every time. Mm -hmm. So people use that opportunity sometimes to do what they right. want to do. And that's why we are at where we are. Wow. Well, 
you know the news now it's always best to have people that know what they're about and know what is best for your building so in the future you don't have to pay for it or suffer for it that's amazing so from here where do we go so from the compaction mm -hmm. uh, we're now going to be having the dpm okay do our plumbing works i'll be speaking again when we have all those things done okay have our ground beams yeah and then we'll prepare for casting yay but i can <laughs> see i can see the chairman of the hoa phase two I can see him right there. Hello. Mr. Conte, can you join us here? Can you join us here? <laughs> it's always good to have him. I think uh, yes. he came down about two days ago. Oh, and so he's on the site. of the homeowners. Exactly. And he's here at Phase 3. Uh, let me also be quick to add that mm -hmm. we are having the expansion yes. of Phase 3. Yes. And so he's here to see for himself. Uh, camera, let's, <laughs> let's have Mr. Conte, let's have him join us. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, somebody was asking me that now that we are expanding phase three, is there any way the other phases will see an expansion? Because there's somebody that really wants to be at phase one. I don't know why, but he's been bugging me for the longest time. So he's like, will there be an expansion there as well? Okay, so as of now, mm -hmm. we are not expanding phase one. Okay. But let the person come see us. We have okay. some few lots. Uh, that are still available nice. and we will be able to see what we can do okay welcome mr chairman hello good afternoon good afternoon hi good afternoon. <laughs> i'm getting yourself how are you doing, I'm I'm doing good. very well good. welcome back to ghana <laughs> thank you very much to the motherland it's a pleasure to be here awesome 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 so now that you're here you've seen the construction you've seen the expansion what do you think about the whole thing uh, extremely impressive that's good amazing <laughs> and uh, we need to also announce um, mm -hmm. we're starting the security post yes for phase two and phase three mm -hmm. and we have the machines uh, moving up and down yeah um, sometimes machine work may fail you so chairman is actually here to ensure that the promises that we are giving we are actually sticking by yes. those promises <laughs> and, uh, he has been here all day okay um we have started some work today we are going to continue tomorrow okay and the day after tomorrow as well nice yeah. that's so amazing. when is the uh, work moving over to phase two so today what we're doing is um we did some clearing we are moving materials up and down uh phase two is our next stop tomorrow morning first thing tomorrow morning we move to phase two okay we start the area for the uh security post as well tomorrow excellent yeah. are you excited Brilliant. to be getting your security post absolutely i think it will also <laughs> encourage more homeowners yeah. to you know believe in the vision that royal kingdom have given to all of us yeah and the commencement of the security post will be at the beginning of the perimeter wall yeah and therefore you can as you can see there are a number of projects going on in phase two yeah and it's great to hear that you know that work has been undertaken so those of you that hesitant please come along start building materials are cheaper they'll be more expensive in weeks and months to come <laughs> <laughs> yeah that's amazing the best time to build as it's you now. always say is it's now exactly so amazing. get on board if you're hesitant just come build your property build your dream home and enjoy it for yourself <laughs> all right thank you very much chairman you're welcome it's a pleasure having you here as always and guys thank you so much this has been the update video we'll definitely come back with more so stay glued to the channel